Greg Rickard has had two major soap roles, one as Kevin Fisher on The Young and The Restless, and the other as Leo on Days of Our Lives. We just can't get enough of him on both the shows, but if you had to pick, who would be your favorite character? We hope this video will make it a little easy for you to help pick your choice. Hey everyone, welcome to Trend Street. Greg Rickard has been in the soap industry since he made his debut on Young and the Restless as Kevin Fisher back in 2003. After making his mark on the soap, he went on to join another one of the best daytime dramas, Days of Our Lives. Rickard joined the cast of Days as Leo Stark in 2018 and has been around there ever since. He even starred in the spin-off limited series, Beyond Salem. In fact, he's been nominated for Daytime Emmy for both the soaps, and in 2005, he even won one. So, which one is his best character? Let's find out starting with their journey. On Days, Leo Stark was first introduced to the audience as Sonny Kiriaki's love interest. Leo starts off as a likable character, but things take a drastic turn when he reveals that he is actually working for Vivian Alamein to steal Titan Industries. Sonny and Leo's relationship becomes rocky when Leo slaps Sonny with a sexual harassment lawsuit and demands money. Sonny is forced to marry Leo to keep him quiet, but Leo is killed in self-defense during an altercation. However, Leo is later revealed to be alive, and blackmails Sonny and Will Horton into a marriage, to gain access to the Kiriaki's fortune. Leo's mother, Diana Cooper, then came in, exposing his lies, and Leo ultimately leaves Salem, after a failed attempt to annul the marriage. Then in 2021, Leo returned to compete in a drag competition for a priceless gem. Leo stole the gem and later helped Sonny and will prevent a terrorist attack planned by Drew Donovan. In 2022, Leo returned as Craig Wesley's boyfriend. Leo and Sonny became friends, and Sonny invited him to live in the Kiriaki's mansion. Leo worked as a gossip columnist, tried to stop Gwen's wedding to Dimitri, and later helped Dimitri escape from the police. Leo blackmailed Sloane Peterson, who had Nicole's baby, and teamed up with Vivian to scheme against Nicole and her allies. So in short, Leo is a manipulative and deceitful character, almost similar to Kevin Fisher. Speaking of Kevin Fisher, he first appeared on The Young and the Restless in 2003 as an internet predator who seduced Lily Winters, giving her an STD, and attempted to kill her friend, Colleen Carlton. Kevin was accused of killing Brittany Hodges, but was defended by his brother Michael Baldwin and mother Gloria Fisher. After a dark period in prison and dealing with his abusive father Tom, Kevin began to rebuild his life. He eventually married Jenna Hawks, who turned out to be quite troubled herself. After Jenna's death, Kevin formed a close friendship with Mariah Copeland, which briefly became romantic. But they both realized they were better off as friends. Kevin eventually married Chloe Mitchell, who had a daughter named Bella, later revealed to be Kevin's child. Chloe left town after being exposed for her role in Adam Newman's death, and Kevin returned to help out in Genoa City. Despite his darker side resurfacing at times, Kevin and Chloe were thrilled to welcome their son, Miles. No matter what, Kevin has always been there for his family in times of need, like protecting Chloe when she unwittingly framed Adam for poisoning Ray, or in New Year's when he helped his mother Gloria in a blackmail scheme. So, to find out which character the fans love the most, we took it to our community post to seal the deal. Kevin takes the win with 88% votes, while Leo got 12% of the vote. One of the fans said, Kevin on Young Restless, he has been on that show a long while, no one can ever play Kevin except Craig. Do you all agree with this comment? We believe all of you have your own opinion, and we would like to hear them from you in the comments below. Thank you for checking this video out. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for new videos every day. Turn that bell notification on if you want to hear from us and comment down below if you've subscribed and we'll make sure to reply and thank as many of you as we possibly can.